Once the script has been approved, it's time for you, the director, to take the reins and begin your journey of interpretation. I spend a lot of time just thinking about the script, meditating the scenes and the characters and focusing on what it is that makes me feel. This feeling could be an image or a word and sometimes even a concept. A good way to plot the journey of your interpretation is by having an ideas book, a place where you can practically store all the ideas that come to you while reading the script. Saving or sticking down pictures, making notes on the script and generally just putting everything down that you think or feel. Having a singular place for these ideas will help you later. Once I have a substantial amount of work in my ideas book, I begin to look for patterns. Ideas or visual elements that have repeated themselves and come up multiple times. This to me is an indicator that my intuition is onto something. The process of refinement is important because you'll have way too much stuff. Focus on what the story is, what the heart is and how you intend to communicate that heart, that idea. Get the broad strokes in place and communicate these to the HODs so that they can begin their own journey of discovery and interpretation. Think about the way you feel you want to move with a camera, the type of sets and designs you want to introduce into the world. Colors and even character specific elements can be decided on at this point. Now I begin to work per scene. What it is that I want to communicate in this scene? How do I want to pace this scene? And which character's scene is this and why? If you can answer these questions, then the blocking and camera positions begin to reveal themselves and you can thus move on to shot listing and storyboarding. Interpreting a script is about intuition, taste, research and communication what it is that your intuition leans toward and how does what you like and your taste define that intuition. What in your research is creating a narrative layer that does not yet exist in the script. And finally, what are you trying to communicate and how are you going to do that? Each of these questions leads to a thought tree that you should explore to ensure that you as the director can defend your choices and know why you're doing something one way and not another way.